Cartoon recaps here. Today I will be recapping the movie called, The Spies in Disguise. Spoilers ahead, relax and enjoy. The movie begins with what seems to be a bomb about to be defused. But in reality it's just a kid genius called Walter Beckett carrying out an experiment. His mom officer Wendy Beckett enters and sees him using her cell phone in the experiment, but he tries to stop her from getting angry by detonating his glitter bomb, to demonstrate that glitter releases serotonin which makes people happy. His mom tells him to get prepared for school, but he doesn't want to go because the kids thinks he's weird. But his mom assures him that one day, the world will need his type of weirdness. 14 years later in Japan, a professional spy called Lance Sterling is infiltrating the headquarters of global arms dealer called Katsuki Mura, who is about to hand over a bioweapon called the M9 assassin to a mysterious buyer called Killian. Lance successfully enters the basement, and is able to take out a number of Kimura's gangs in several skillful ways, while Killian is already there, and is about to collect the weapon. As Lance demands the weapon from Kimura, the fat villain preferably goes to attack him but Lance defeats him with not much effort. He then demands the weapon from Killian, but knowing he isn't going to get the weapon without a fight, he fires a chip to put him down, but it turns out that Killian isn't any ordinary opponent. But Lance is able to defend himself and as he is about to fight back, a whole lot of Kimura gang confronts him, which gives Killian the chance to get away with the weapon. As Lance sees himself surrounded by the goons, he ends up using Walter Glitter Bomb to subdue them. The gadget worked in distracting the gangs, but the Killian is already getting away. Immediately, Lance launches himself out of the basement, and jumps through Killian Chopper to retrieve the weapon and get away. Lance returns back to the agency in Washington, where everyone praises him for his successful mission. He feels dissatisfied with Walter's gadgets and goes to complain to him about it. Walter works at the corner office where he develops gadgets for spies. As Lance arrives at Walter's office, he scolded Walter for developing gadgets that doesn't work the way he wants them to work. As Walter tires to defend himself, by explaining to him that the best way of completing missions is by maybe causing a distraction or something. Instead of him making grenades that takes lives, Lance is really disappointed by his statement, and has Walter fired. Lance goes to meet with the director called, Joy Jenkins to hand over the M9 weapon to her. But unfortunately, the case he grabbed off of Killian turns out to be empty. Suddenly, the internal affairs agent called Marcy Koppel enters with her teammates and tells the director that it was Lance that stole the weapon. They proved it by showing everyone the footage of what appears to be Lance escaping with the weapon, but it is really Killian disguising himself as Lance to frame him. Lance tries to explain that this was a setup but the agents instead tries to arrest him. Suddenly he creates a diversion that allows him to get away. Now the only option for Lance to trace the whereabouts of Kimura so it can find and capture Killian to clear his name. But first he needs to find Walter to produce a gadget to help him in disguise from the agents who are in pursuit for him. Walter stays alone with his pet pigeon Lovey. His mom Wendy has died a long time ago living Walter alone. Making use of Lovey's feathers, he is able to achieve a perfect formula for his disappearing technology. Lance later arrives at Walter's house to ask for his help. Walter holding the formula in his hand, asks Lance if there is anything he can offer him. But Lance immediately grabs the formula from his hand and drinks it thinking it's a regular water. Walter freaks out, and explains to Lance that he has just drank a chemical substance, which is going to turn him to a pigeon in 45 seconds. Lance doesn't believe what he says and thinks it's a waste of time for visiting Walter in the first place. As he is about to leave, he started to experience extreme discomfort in his body. He thought it was just Walter getting his revenge for getting him fired. After a long pain and discomfort, he suddenly transforms to a pigeon. Lance freaks out when he sees himself as a pigeon, and threatens Walter to change him back but unfortunately, he doesn't currently have the antidote. To make matters worse, Walter has already informed the agency that Lance is at his house, unaware that Lance is now a fugitive. Lance explains to Walter that a criminal called Killian is trying to frame him and he has to catch him in time and clear his name before it's too late. Lance tries to go off on his own, but he couldn't because he is now a pigeon. Lance realizes he couldn't do this without Walter, and begs for his assistance. Suddenly they both make their escape. Marcy and her agent sees Lance's car getting away, and head off to chase after them. Lance tells Walter to use a firepower to escape from other agents, but Walter wants to just use a simple oil slick, so the agents won't be harmed. As Walter activates it, this causes their car's systems to temporarily shut down and almost cause them to crash. But they managed to make their escape from the agents, and started to plan on their next move. Lance and Walter arrives at Mexico after tracking Kimura there. They arrive at the hotel where Kimura is staying, 
and Walter reminds Lance that he is now a pigeon, and can sneak past Kimura's goons undetected. As Lance tries to get Kimura's room key from the front desk, some other pigeon keeps messing it up for him, until an hotel staff sees him, and throws Lance in the trash. But fortunately for Lance, a pigeon had managed to swallow the card, and spit it up for Lance. As Walter follows him, Lance tells him that he can handle the mission on his own from here. Lance goes to where Kimura was, and tries to attack Kimura, but finds that he is not as effective as a bird. Suddenly, Walter shows up uses his pen gadget, that causes a temporary paralysis on Kimura. And then added a truth serum that makes Kimura confess about the whereabouts of Killian. As they notice that Marcy and her team are at the door, they hurry out of the window to make their escape. After attempting to jump to a nearby balcony, Walter falls but he is able to hold on to a grappling hook. The other agents are able to reach them, and as Walter tries to use his pen against the agents, it gets swallowed by a pigeon bird which resulted to it shooting a gum-like substance on the agents, allowing Walter and Lance to escape. Marcy and her team sees this and becomes astonished that Walter used something harmless to subdue everyone. She then contacts the director informing that she hasn't seen any trace of Lance apart from a feather. Lance and Walter are able to make their way to Venice where Killian is. As Lance and Walter are about to make their way inside the building, Marcy and her team shows up and try to convince Walter to reveal Lance's whereabouts. Marcy reminds Walter about his mom being a cop, and the sacrifices she made to save her fellow officers. But Walter rejects Marcy's request to turn Lance in. She hears an explosion in the building, and cuffs Walter outside while she and her teammates enters the building to find out what is going on. Lance frees Walter and they head off to continue the mission on their own. But Killian had already used the M9 weapon to acquire a database, the only option is for Lance to fly and retrieve the database, but he is scared to do so but Walter pushes him off the building to make him to fly, while falling he is assisted by two other pigeon who helps him to fly, they are able to catch up to the database, but Killian knocks Walter down and as he is about to harm him, he throws breadcrumbs on Killian which attracts a massive flock of pigeon him, giving Walter and Lance the chance to make their escape. Marcy and her team later arrives and tells Killian to surrender, but he changes his face to Lance to fool the agents and creates a diversion that allows him to get away. Lance and Walter rides on a submarine to where Killian's is, and Walter is finally able to make the antidote using one of Lovey's feathers. This successfully turns Lance back into a human. Immediately they get to Killian's basement. Lance orders Walter to go back because he plans to kill Killian. But Walter begs him not to kill Killian instead he should find another way to stop him, as Lance sees their argument is getting anywhere, he tranquilizes him and sends him away, fearing that he might get killed in the process of helping out in the mission. Lance goes to the top of Killian's basement, but he gets captured by Killian. Killian reveals to Lance that he has created thousands of drones to locate where Lance's agents are, and kill them all. Suddenly, Killian gets a warning sign from his computer that his basement has been breached, which means Walter is coming back to save Lance. Killian sends two drones after Walter and forces Lance to watch. An explosion is seen in the water, and as Lance sees Walter's submarine explosion, he is so devastated thinking Walter has been killed. As Killian sends his drones toward Washington to terminate all Lance agents, Walter is revealed to have survived by using his inflatable hug protection bubble. Lance apologizes to Walter for looking down on him, and they both reconciled. Walter also sends a message to Marcy and her agents for assistance. Lance is able to catch Killian, and they both go on a one-on-one -on -one combat. Marcy also arrives and realizes that Lance is truly innocent after noticing Killian trying to clone Lance's face. They both fight Killian off, while Walter tries hacking into Killian's arm to stop the drone strike from getting to the agency. Meanwhile, the drones have found the agent's secret basement, and as the director tries to lead her agents to safety, the drones have already trapped they all. During the battle, Killian attempts to escape on a drone, but Walter is able to hold on to him. They both get high above the clouds, and Walter is able to hack into Killian's arm. As Walter is about to deactivate the drone, he realizes that Killian will die in the process, and he doesn't want to be a killer while doing so. Suddenly, Walter traps Killian in an inflatable hug he was supposed to use to save himself in the clouds, while he falls and deactivates the drone. Lance sees Walter falling from the sky, believing there is no other option, he turns himself back into a pigeon using a small vial of formula and grabs Walter with the assistance of his pet pigeon Lovey, and the other pigeons. Marcy team are able to find Killian, and he is presumably taken into custody. As the both of them returns back to the agency, Lance and Walter are both fired for breaking a whole lots of rules as agents. Just as they start to look on the bright side, they are abducted and thrown into a van, but it's just a plan by Marcy and Jenkins. They want Walter to lead a new team, 
as they were impressed by his harmless gadgets. The film ends with Lance and Walter now working together as a team, along with the pigeons as their backup. Thank you for watching guys. If you love animation movies, please subscribe to this channel and keep watching.